Hi guys, welcome back to VPN Central. Today we will try to answer one of the many questions from Gaming Topic. Steam Unlocked is a noteworthy player in the dynamic world of online gaming, offering easy access to an expansive library of pre-installed PC games, all without the price tag. But the question remains, is Steam Unlocked safe? Let's dive in with the video and answer the question. No, using Steam Unlocked to download cracked games isn't considered safe due to the potential risks this carries. Additionally, links within the platform may redirect you to potentially dangerous phishing sites, increasing the likelihood of hacking attempts or data theft. Before we delve into the subject, let's establish that we don't condone any form of illegal usage or distribution of copyrighted content. However, if you do find yourself using such websites, here are some tips to help you have a more secure experience. It's crucial to keep your antivirus updated to safeguard your system from potential threats, and even more so when downloading content from the internet. Malware often infects systems through ads, making it advisable to avoid interacting with any of them. If you really need to click on an ad, for example, to get a game, only do it on reliable websites. You can identify suspicious files by assessing their size and extensions. Genuine games are typically multiple gigabytes in size, so if you see a really small file or a type you don't recognize, it's better not to download it. ExpressVPN encrypts your internet traffic and protects you against malware and other potential threats. While employing a VPN is a sound practice during any internet activity, it becomes especially necessary when navigating platforms like Steam Unlocked. To minimize risks while using Steam Unlocked, only purchase games from trusted sources. Given the fact that malicious files often disguise themselves as game downloads, relying solely on established and reputable websites is the safest path forward. So, is Steam Unlocked safe? Yes, if you update your antivirus software, avoid clicking on ads, check file sizes and extensions, and use a reputable VPN. Thank you so much for tuning in today. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss an update. I'm Mike here at VPN Central. See you later.